This is a piece of shit. Okay, yeah, you got a manual. You can get here. It's a goddamn, goddamn piece of fucking shit. There. Oh, there we go. Hey. Yeah. You sure? <laughs> Can't quite close the door because the post is no longer attached to the bottom of the car. There is no bottom to the car. Hey Franker, smells like death. How's it handle? Great. Little pull to the left. No speedo. Risk it. Come on, Frankers! <laughs> no way, shit. Taking the shortcut. In tow. Nice. Few obstacles. Okay, out you go. Yeah, we're good. Tell me when I can cut it. You bet. Limit. Okay, you can start cutting. Yeah, we're good, Chase. Yeah, cut, cut. Straight, 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 straight.
bar on that thing to see if it'll turn. No. Sabotaging my my ride already. Vicky tapping me, taking it over. Trying to do it the easiest, <laughs> laziest way. A kick on. And hey, guess what? It's not working. There. Is it in? There you go. Yeah, that's on. That's on. Good. Look okay, at the speeds it's going. going. Yeah. So far zero. Hubcaps coming off. Oh, Jesus. That's too bad. That, that, uh, this is an impressive display of miles. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Chalk it up with something there. Yeah, no. I got it. Okay. It's like we're water skiing. Hit it! Hit it! <laughs> We haven't seen this one for a while out in the open. This is a 1947 Kaiser Special that I bought as a parts car. One of three I bought from uh, from Reynolds Museum. Uh, when I was fixing up the Fraser, so what year was that? 2015? Uh, I don't think I was hanging around then. No. I bought it as a parts car. I never actually took any parts off of it. <laughs> and then I saw that the engine turned, so I took all my parts off of the car with the seized engine. And then I gave that to Clayton, and I saved, and I saved this one. All right. If I need a fry bar, I'll get one. Oh, there we go. Nice. Oh, there you go. So what changed? I don't know. Right. Doesn't matter. We took some pressure off the linkage yeah, by jacking maybe. the car up. Maybe. That, you know, that's why I started Will It Run, because it was so much easier yeah. to do shit like this if you could just put a battery put in. Put a battery in. Yeah, for sure. I need the battery. Or collect better parts. That's more money though. That's it's too huh? expensive. I said or collect better parts. Looks like it's always been there. That's the thing with uh, <laughs> nicely aged vehicles as soon as you park them in the past, they've always been there. Yeah, it looks like it's always been there. <laughs> right ahead, so. Okay, what goes here again? Plymouth. 
basically landed right where the Plymouth Okay, go that way then if you can. Okay. Hey. Right there. Okay, do it, boy. Stop, 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 stop. Stand in front of your chosen Stand weapon. Stand in front, right? Look hold please. on a second, let me clean up then. Shit. Now. He doesn't want to look like a loser it's before a, we even start. It's a, it's a little more Get the dandelions away it's from my car. <laughs> Okay, is that, is that what we're doing? Are we doing, are yeah, we doing some of this? Yeah, yeah, yeah do some like of that. A, yeah, there's your thumbnail like right there. Off, yeah. Eh? yeah, maybe like this. There you go. <laughs> okay. Man, right. that's some raunchy old junk. <laughs> All uh, right. Sweet. Great. Okay. Well, one, two, three, go. Hoods off. Right. Look at him. He's ready to go. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Are we going? Well, I don't know. All right. Let's do it. All right. It's the V8 Summer Showdown. We got two of the most seized up junk V8 two-door hardtop cars that we could find. And so here we go. Miles is team captain of Team Studebaker. This is a 259 cubic inch uh, Studebaker overhead valve V8. It's awesome. And Ash is uh, going to be working on, what do you got here? What is it, a 239? Or what year is this? 53, 54. This is, Ash didn't read the script, I okay. guess. Okay. Cut, go. And Ashley's working on the 1951. <laughs> uh, yeah, Ford Vicky. A pretty awesome car. There's no Wait losers here except That's for us. everybody except me. I thought you were getting paid. I think <laughs> I knew I was donating. Yeah, right? Right, we win nothing. Nobody went well, fame. bragging rights. There's a lot of fame coming. A lot of fame. Is yeah. that what it is? Okay. Yeah, they're both C's. They're both uh, unknowns. So, I mean, we might... You know, if you're watching this, it means that we took the engines apart and decided that they were actually fixable. If you're not watching this, then this is a blooper reel five years later, and uh, neither of them ran. Are we using like hydraulic a... pressure, no, O-ring, seal? <laughs> is any of that <laughs> to happening? To get the engine rotating? Mm, after the last time, no. <laughs> you get fluid and time. That's right. <laughs> That's... Yeah, we could do all sorts of things. Oh, he's got the ability. Oh, there's options for you. Stay full of your Edelbrock people and let's get some bits for yeah, that we thing. Could, Wouldn't that be funny? Sponsored by Edelbrock? Sponsored by Edelbrock? I doubt there's <laughs> any support for this I don't guy, think right? there's much Edelbrock Not stuff for Stewie. Not dollar one, eh? So, I mean, team captain instantly in there. Hey, okay. look right. at how casual Team Studebaker is. Ah, we'll have it run in <laughs> forever. No rush. Yeah, he's secretly got a LS stashed at home that he's just gonna sneak it in overnight and put Studebaker <laughs> valve covers on. Yeah. Four hoses to keep it cool, you know? That's it's right. Fun. So how do you think we should settle it, assuming we get them both running at roughly the same time? A straight up drag race? Drag race, 100%. 100%. Yeah, 100%. Straight grass, up grass drags in the back. Straight up grass drags. Yeah? Yep. How about a long jump? There you go. A long <laughs> jump. <laughs> They're both full framers. You can take it. No, I love a straight up drag race. That'll be fun. All, if they both perform as new, then the Studebaker should have it. Honestly, have it. it's got a lot more horsepower. We don't know what gears are in either one of them, though. But the Studi has posi, too. Twin yeah. traction, as the Studebaker called it. If it's not shot out, right? Well, it's a big if, yeah. Uh, well, this looks like a gem. It's gonna be, yeah. I like If we find minutes. out that yeah. the Studebaker runs an eight and three quarter, I'm swapping gears. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you never know. They may have, they might be. I mean, I doubt they made their own. I bet you if you looked under there, you'd recognize I it. I would, yeah. It might be a, it might be a, uh, a Dana. You know what I like? Like, 
like does that not all look 100% original? Yeah, yeah, I think like, these I are think, original hoses. I think I'm yeah. the first guy to take this off. Yeah, look at how nice yeah. those are not chowdered at right. all. Yeah. You and, might be and. the first guy to change the oil too. <laughs> we don't know. Yeah, no, I love it. Yeah. So this is a later one, right? No. With the proper distributor. That's why I thought it was an eight, a fifty-three, because I thought that eight BA was. Oh, okay. Was, I have no uh, idea what that is. That's what the okay. guys. That's what the yeah. guys want. Yeah. That's what I've the cool kids that. want. Oh, this is the motor you want? This yeah, is, this, this is, is the, the, the that, last this is of the them. Big yeah. One? yeah. Did we check the oil? Oh, some yeah. full. Good sign. Good sign. Of course, the uh, Buick looked pretty good too until you took the pan off <laughs> and it was an inch of oil on top of six inches of water. I hope these are not as bad as that. We don't have that kind of time. Those were bad. Although the Packard was not terrible. That thing was sticky though. That was really sticky. Remember doing when that? We got that thing going though. As a matter of fact, if we stuck a battery in that Packard right now, it would start. Well, that so, thing. It's, so, it, so it's the Buick, wouldn't it? Yeah, oh yeah, we did. We started it already this year. Oh, there you go. Yeah, the Buick yeah, like starts. Just, all of that is so nice. Like. Yeah, well, save it because the budget's oh, zero. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. I'm saving it because yeah. you would clean them up and, and yeah. put no. them back on. It's good. I'd like to see how good we could make this look, you know, within reason. No painting allowed, I don't think. We don't need to paint, but we do need to clean it up. So we're going to... Yeah, let's blow it off. Let's uh... uh how about we combine some air, some screwdrivers and a vacuum cleaner and we'll blow and, and vacuum at the same time and just kind of pick all this stuff, you know. Sure. And uh we'll do both cars cuz yeah. that's number 1. Maybe Miles and I will take off this hood while you do that. Sure. So I'm going to pull this, this, these cuz they'll just be in the way. Yeah. I suspect that there's a stuck valve or 7. I'm gonna pull the plugs. Yep. Sure. Ash has got a six volt car, and I believe the Studi is a 12 volt car. So, Advantage Studebaker. I have to say, I wasn't expecting this level of response for Summer Showdown. The rubber broke. Yeah. I just they fell out. Did, are they not attached to the valve cover? No. Um, they were. Well, a couple there. of them were busted. Oh. Cool. They were just Look at that. Mine were all good. Scott, good. do I get so Matt and Jim on my team? Yeah. Yeah, no ringers. No ringers. No, every team is handicapped with me. Oh, I see. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, well, let's just Okay, zap so these let me get really? uh, an impact then. Head's coming off I here. So. I mean, we'll deal with that oil filter. Yeah, yeah for sure. Ringers, what do you think? Same as always. See that? You are doing right? this again. Mark has jumped right onto Team Sudebaker. Yep. Must be the allure of the. Oh, we're big guys. We like full size cars. Right. None of that small Vicky stuff over there. God, it's always just, you know, strange cars. Oh, what the fuck's going on in there? <laughs> None of us have ever worked on one of these engines. I think that's really cool. Yeah. That'll all be fine. So, is it a Studebaker engine? Then? It is a Studebaker. Is a they Studebaker. made their own engine, and yeah. apparently, it's a very close copy of Cadillac's first overhead valve. Look at that. I bet it's oh. mechanical like, flat almost they cam got sued. with roller rockers. Look at that. Shaft drive adjustable. There's nothing but power in this baby. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, really these cool. Things were, these things would fly. You know, that's not ruined either. Like, no, no, that looks shape. good. Look that's, at the size of the push rods. It's, in good it's shape. a robust Those, setup. That's going to last we forever. Got all I need is a dual four setup and I'll get you like a horsepower per, per cubic inch. No problem. There's Blow the body right ready, off, there's part ready to go. Yeah. We just don't want to see catastrophic failure at this stage of the game. We gotta get get right in there before we see the real nightmare. Before we see the hole. There's no holes in the block, right? We did give a quick boo there. Well there's oil in it. Oh yeah, so it can't be too big of a hole. Water pump and spins. That full. Looks good. Nothing looks damaged there. Okay. Everything's attached. This is all right, cool. Mr. Flathead. That's up. Uh, wow, dude. What are we doing here? It's on a straight oh, line. I just mean, pulling heads. It's, it's, it's yeah, but pulling heads on this versus this pulling heads on that. Yeah. Cool. Well, used to be the way they did it. But look at all the cleaning I have to do. Where's Dean? Yeah, where's Dean? That's that's a great question. Well, Dean's a Ford guy. Yeah, we may as well do this now, otherwise it will all be in the bores of the cylinder. I'm stuck. Everything looks good. Should run. Ooh. 
that ranch ash? Just going for it. You could do it in an order if you wanted. Yeah, okay. Just hammer, yeah, Just hammer it. Just hammer it. Just give her. It's flat rate, man. Well, we need uh, got a flat rate. We got a half inch ratchet. Uh, yes. We got a flat the, rate, the flat head. That's right, it's a flat rate head, that's what they call it. Why don't we crack them by hand? Yeah, and once you're they're cracked, we'll it. buzz them out. You're overthinking it. Nice ratchet. I was yeah. going to say, that ratchet <laughs> is garbage. Yeah. No, that one's fine. Oh, that's okay. Just the impact will do damage without even knowing it. See, this is flat rate over here. No problem, right? Just flying through. You on that side of the car, I'll be on this side of the car. Right? We're making money. Alright, let's go. You're getting paid? <laughs> Again, paid? That was the rumor. Mm. That's why I showed up. Okay. The yeah. rumor was going yeah. started by me. <laughs> you guys are just going for it, hey? Eh? Well, it's all got to be done. Well, they got to make up for the fact that it's not a flathead. So. Well, that's right. Team Flathead has the advantage. <sighs> yeah, like you guys, you guys are going to know right away, and it's we're probably gonna know, just going to be. Yeah, we're going to know in 12 minutes, and we'll be yeah. back together. Okay, show yeah. over. <laughs> Show's <laughs> over. Yeah. Pass you the gear. Everybody go home. The hammer, it. Yeah. Let's, let's <laughs> smack these seats back. It took longer cars. to move the cars into position than to fix them. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Well, that didn't sound good. You never mind. That sounds like an unforced <laughs> error over there. <laughs> yeah. We're going to run it with uh, 23 studs. <laughs> it's a flathead, it should do it. There's a bunch of these. Are so we're going to be rattling them in and out. What's that? that one's the open. vacuum advance. No, I think all, there was only two or three bad ones. That one in the corner to start. Ooh. <laughs> Let's see Thing, Miles. <laughs> you bet. You steal the intake, take it home, take the heads <laughs> home. Take this wrench and shave the edges down. And if we're about to see how the rest of the summer goes around here, we at least. Have a drum roll. Yeah. I'll dub in. A but drum we roll. did decide no hydraulic pressure. Yeah, that's right. That was a. That's fine. Uh oh, is it? Is it? Yeah. Okay. It looked a little shorter. Just a little. No, it's good. It's no, fine. it's okay. Yeah. All right. Okay, then. is that all of them? Um... Oh, yeah. Look at you, eh? I think so. Hey, okay. Steven. One, two, three. Drum roll. Oh. oh We're under there. the yeah. distributor. Hold that. And we got to get the distributor out of the way enough. Yeah. Oh, there you go. That'll work. Okay. All right. The gasket's staying on the engine. All right. <laughs> That's pretty shitty. Yeah, we're we'll probably going to have to get a gasket. <laughs> uh, yeah. And what are you not gonna uh, <laughs> That's not garbage. No, no it'll not, be fine. Yeah. We might have a burnt valve. No, we got a burnt valve for sure. Oh, yeah. We yeah. got two. Two burnt valves? Yeah. Oh, fuck, it'll run forever. Okay. Well, I'm so, sure you can't get those. Um, But that's okay. We'll have to send, yeah. Those are and exhaust, those be, right? Those should be resin. Those will be on the shelf. Oh, yeah. So, oh, yeah. That, none of that's hard. Good. Now we got a poly intake. Okay, out okay. you go. So that should do it. There we go. Nice. Intake off. Oh, okay. oh, oh no. right. For something. <laughs> oh, a spring. Hey, I was looking for that. Your carburetor springs. Yeah. Some shit. That's cool. This is like the Chrysler. It's like a Buick. Yeah, Chrysler's is like that. The Buick's isn't it? that that too. Buick's yeah. nail heads are like that. Yeah. Okay, great. Must be early Chrysler. There. Okay. We might as well save these because we do not know if we can get any of this well, stuff. Well, we won't be able to get any of this stuff. Uh, yeah, probably Luckily, put, put exactly that probably in the car. Right I'm dirty. Take the distributor out or you want to leave it in? Oh, I maybe leave it Put it in the top dead center first. Okay. Well, <laughs> 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 fucking move. 
Um, it doesn't fucking matter for getting the heads off, so since that's what we're really worried about, we might be able to do the whole... No, the distributor will go on the machine before it goes back in, but for now, sure, leave it. It's just in... It doesn't need way. to come out. It's not involved in the heads. Yeah. Oh, but if we're pulling heads, we got exhaust manifolds, eh? Yucky. Oh, fuck. Yucky. Right? Yeesh. And that's got some big funky Didn't crossover Didn't you guys have exhaust manifolds to deal with? No. No, 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 no not so much. What the fuck is wrong with that engine? Flathead. How does it run? <laughs> <laughs> well, the manifolds are bolted to the block. It's a made-up engine. That's a made-up. <laughs> it was made up. It was made up 20 years before this. That is quite a water pump, isn't it? Yeah, yeah there's a I lot like of bolts lot. going on yeah, there. That's cool. And then the only part you need to rebuild is the part that comes out. Yeah, it's nice. The rest of it's just a big, lovely old casting. Yeah, I bore that wreck. Shit. Go. Oh. I'm not done with it. Oh, okay. I got one what more. do you need, Ash? I got one more for sure. I got a Better tools. I need a little mini pack. More tools. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you going to pull this head, too? Right. You guys good for tools for now? So far, so far. Okay, I want to see this water pump come off. Nice. Yeah, manifolds, fellas. That's gonna suck. That's yeah, a it's... wrench job by the looks of it. Yeah, it's a wrench job. All right, flathead team. Tap. Oh wow, those are rusty. Okay, that one's good. Get a nine sixteen foot there. Uh, yeah, it's a side with the oil filter. That's the, the gum duff. Oh, it's broken. Of course it is. Of course. They're all broken. What's broken? The oil oh, filter. the oil filter bracket. They all do. Yeah. Okay. I don't think I've seen one that isn't. They all do that. Oh, and there's no oil coming out of it. But there's a bunch of <laughs> bunch of what? Never seen that. I don't know what that is. There's a hard line. Oh, is that for the gauge? Oh, sure. It's probably for a pressure gauge, so we don't want to break that. So yeah, underneath the center gallery, you can look and see what the camshaft looks like. Just wondering how many. It looks like two bolts there, two bolts there. Anything underneath? Oh, well, I got a Studebaker watch, and they're a bitch. So if there's they? anything like it. We ready? Let's see. Get ready to plug and laugh. Oh. We're stuck on a dipstick. That's not dipstick. me. That's not me. This time. Okay, I got it. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! oh, oh, oh. That's a minus. Somebody that is, I oh, wish. Okay, it's rust. But is it rust? Yeah. Rust? Yeah. It's rust or moisture. Ooh, that's right? a lot of rust. Holy that's cow. Yeah. Look at that valve. Wow, at first I thought it was molten steel. Yeah, we weren't going to get that to turn over with a wrench. That valve's oh, not coming out on its own. Oh my goodness. That's not good. How's the other ones? <laughs> let's just, let's get some positive vibes here. Okay, well, we need uh, could be head gasket. I mean, it looked yeah. like you had water coming in around there, too. Uh, and that's exhaust valve, right? Look at this. Like, look at, look that. at that. That is Weird. like, yeah. well, that's, well that's, 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 that's what the Packard intake looked like, though. Why would you have moisture around the exhaust valve, though? Uh, well, this <laughs> is an intake valve. Yeah. There's coolant that That's runs through exhaust. that head. Right? So it's either, is there any most skeletons in here? No, that's just water. That is. Signs of a head gasket. That is. That's maybe a blown head gasket. Wow, that, that's that is. Holy shit. That is oh, you know what? It'll go. She'll go. That's, that's, that's not great. That's not great. That's no. not great at all. Is that catastrophic? No. no. She'll run. I'm not worried. But it might be hydraulic pressure. No, it'll go. Um, well. Yeah, I'm vacuuming it out. You agree? Yeah, yeah, for sure. It's a little rustier and I would have liked to see. Something's packed in here, you see? That valve is rusted right to the head. This is just more than that. That's weird, though. The rest of them are fine. This is the only one that has gone sideways. And boy, did it. Look at this. It could Dude. have been left outside with a spark plug out, I guess. Without water in it. 
One way or another, that has gone very bad for <laughs> Oh, and I thought it'd be running tonight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Um, I bet you were... That old. is not great. Compared to the Buick, that's nothing. That will always be the high water It is mark nice that we have that. For me. We ha yeah. yeah, exactly. So, um, and whatever's happened there, yeah, I just don't understand how water got. It may be a head blown gasket? head gasket. Is it on it still? It must be. It's got to be on one of no, those. No, it's on the head, I think. Okay. No. no. No, it is there. No, that is it on there. Do you see any sign of it leaking into there? Not on this side of it. Peel it off and look at the other side. Pretty hard to tell down here, though. Looks pretty wide already. It'd be brutal, eh? Because you get all new. What do you mean? You can replace your head gas. Oh shit, yeah. yeah. Well, you might be. Able well, we're gonna try. Not really seeing anything too no, obvious. Don't see anything. Yeah, the back ones are gonna be a bitch. Hmm. Doesn't mean that it didn't blow a head gasket, but it's just it's not super obvious. And they're anyway. closed. Fresh air. As in, I think those valves look like they were closed. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Smoking gun. No, no smoking gun. Closest thing I can see to a smoking gun is uh, no missing part spark plug for too long. Well, the, the, the cylinder full of rust isn't. Yeah, but what caused it? Yeah, I guess. Oh, okay. Don't bother? Well, I was going to scrape it all out and vacuum it first. Well, I did that. But I didn't scrape it. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. It's, we're certainly not going to hurt it. I'll give it a little more cleaning with a little wire wheel and a little sandpaper and we'll uh, wire wheel yeah. off the valves so, and then we'll just soak everything in Gibbs and let it sit. And I just wanted to see if it goes away. Oh, it Wood block and tabby <laughs> tabby. <laughs> that ain't going nowhere. That'll that, be there. That that'll, 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 that's like your pool. Well, that's okay. We wouldn't want it to be too easy. No, no. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Would you pay for this thing? Yeah. Uh, the, thing, the buddy said it was a new one. Yeah, engine. he said it was good. Yep. No, he never said it was good. But he did say he tried to get it running, so... Wow, it that could mean that, a lot of things. Yeah, but it, it means his dad didn't say, that thing is f Right. So it might not... It probably sometime in the last 60 years... It got it got water in it. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Well, that's all we know, right? Yeah, that's all we know. Yeah. Totally. What are you guys doing? Manifolds? The exhaust manifolds. Yeah. Oh, nice. What I got? Yeah, I got them all except the yeah, last really one. Like okay, let's find Menace Dog. The head has not released in any way, but all that valve train sitting loose. Uh, you could pull it off. I'm kind of thinking it should. Hopefully, being able to put it back together and not lose anything. Of course, these bolts are going to be so As long as you keep hard. them set, like, on the, the correct side. Look at those bolts. Oh. No stretch in that, eh? None. It'll be good for another hundred years. <laughs> I'm going back in no matter what. <laughs> drafty, drafty. <laughs> Just the haze. <laughs> oh, you gotta cut the blow by cam from the forklift. <laughs> oh, did you? Did, 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 the blow by cam was so awesome. <laughs> the blow by cam. <laughs> that thing is never. <laughs> Did you ever oh, see it? No. Oh man, does that thing blow? It does, yeah. yeah. That thing makes, but we didn't make a Why isn't before? that a fucking thing? Oh, the best part is like it blows oh, right into the cab, too. It <laughs> doesn't. Oh, it's terrible. Oh, hold on that's a, a pressure rod, eh? Yeah, I was going to say, that's like 7 sixteenths. Or it's a 7 sixteenths. Oh, yeah, trench. they're big. Is that half sure. inch? No. They're 7 sixteenths for sure. I like that they're a foot long. Oh, fuck. But, but they're, they're, if you're they're, building, they're go big. Serious. That's fun. That's crazy, eh? And look, oil's coming out of them. You guys are out. You guys are out. Watch the starter drivers jam. They're even that's straight. Yeah. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with them. No, it could have just been...
I think I have to loosen this off. Well, uh, I, don't, ooh, I know it's like yes. yeah, you yeah, do. there's another one right there. Yeah, I see that now. Yeah, All carbon, right, well, carbon action. There is <laughs> the mean, rusty look, cylinder. It's got kind of charcoal briquettes in there. I like Steven. Oh man. Oh, there we go. Save it. Save it. Save it's it. Oh, look at oh that. my god. It'll run. Oh. How depressing. What is that? What happens when you never change that oil? That has never had the oil changed. You guys want to see what a car with 100,000 miles and the oil's never been changed? Oh my god. <laughs> this is Titanic. Oh, oil Something wasn't cheap blew up in there. What in the fuck is that? That yeah, is a one good. owner car who never changed the oil. Yeah, that's what freshly rebuilt. No oil filter either on this engine, right? Yeah, no, there was. Was there? But the thing is, they don't do a hell of a Clearly. lot. This oh is 100,000 miles. Of... I get a screwdriver. Oh, oh shit. That's awful. Yeah, that's, 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 uh, I've seen that a few Whoa. times. That's the worst thing you know, I've ever seen. All needed was a starter drive. <laughs> yeah. Well, and you can see the water came in intake oh, here. Oh, there's a spring, there's another sp tiny spring in there that might have fallen out of something there. See way oh, down there. Okay. Uh, all right. Well. Wow, that's fucked up. How did this thing run? If you cut that off, you can put a socket on it and fucking zip it. That that is mental. I mean, unless somebody wants it. This is uh. What do you think? I don't know. It's it's, it's Buick tier. <laughs> Look at that. I have I've no doubt that it'll life. run. It'll run. It's, it's uh, not great, but she'll go. That's definitely the worst I've seen. Well, you know, we'll be able to vacuum that up. It's so dried up that we'll be able to vacuum the oil out of it. <laughs> and reuse it. We'll just, we'll warm it up on the stove the, and stick her back in. There, Pour it through a coffee strainer and quit being a baby. That's funny. I gotta get a picture hey, Scott, before we clean it up. Uh, we'll see. Up uh, oh! Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think we're fucked. I oh, know, that's just the shit you poured down there. Right. Yeah, but right. none of them look great to be. And the with, shit is though. still there. The reveal. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Nothing good. Nothing great. Oh, that's, that's all our juice we yeah. poured down there. I don't know. That back one doesn't look very healthy. <laughs> I don't know, but I don't know why I'm so happy right now. <laughs> no, that, that, that doesn't look that Two bad. Possible engines. <laughs> a little emery no, cloth. This is fine. Oh, fuck, yeah. Yeah. Fuck. Well, this is fine. That one's though. not too bad. This one's a bit rusty, but it's not that bad either. Like, I just wiped the rust off with my we finger. Put the fluid in it. It's not dry. And, no, no, but it's got some pretty w interesting crusty shit in there. Going on. <laughs> Yeah, well, and this is why I didn't want to force that's it. That's right. Because if yeah, we clean right. that up and hone it, there's no real damage there. Is there a ring top ring? Not really. What there's a it? tiny ridge, but the, you could almost rebuild right. this. Like you would basically just give that a hone and that and a ring job, and that's a good. Is there a screwdriver? Right? There's not even enough ridge there to even have to force it out. Oh no. So I think that that is a good idea to save this engine. I don't. Oh, have that's any. not too bad. All of our goo leaked out of that one, so it's totally free, right? Is that a good thing? Yeah, absolutely. It means that it's not seized. All of our goo leaked down into the oil pan. Broken ring and shit just slipped no. by. Well, it can't sit there forever. I guess. Yeah. These ones where it hasn't moved at all. There it goes. <clears throat> okay. We got to walk it off of this stud. That's all. Yeah. Just keep rotating. Get my hand in there and I'll just yank okay. it. There you go. There you go. Okay. Fantastic. And same not, story. Not too bad. Not bad. Actually. This is good. Well, I mean, there's well, there's rust in each one. Yeah. yeah but I mean, there's less rust than mm. yours. Fuck <laughs> Yeah, yeah but is that is that rust or carbon? Yeah, a lot of it's carbon. Yeah. Like that. That is clean. Yeah. And do you think it's from your guys' mixture? Yeah. Well, all this is. Yeah, that red fluid. Yeah, that was us trying to loosen it up. The car, the but this is why yeah. I didn't want to. If you started that, if you got that running, uh, you destroyed the engine in five seconds. Yeah. 
I still want to put a breaker bar on there and see if we can get a rotate. Well, and now, now, now you could, but now we can't. Now we can clean all that up really nice first, vacuum it all, wipe it all out. Gibbs, get as clean as you can, Gibbs. Then we tap on each piston as you back and forth, and then it, it'll break loose for sure. It will, but then we won't wreck it, and it'll be broke no, loose by the next time. You've done this enough times, dude. But We've saved way worse than this. There's a lot of rust in those There's walls, a, but, eh? Yeah. So we can jack up one wheel, put this thing in third. Well, let's try that. Where's yeah. Jack? Right here. And you can't light, do that. And use the wheel. Pausey. Yeah, we have to. Yeah, jack that's how I got the shaft uh, going. Yeah, but we I just turned automatic. the wheel. This is an automatic. Yeah, you still, anyway. still yeah. couldn't do it. Could. But you got a really good bolt on here to do it. Forget so it. So we need an inch and a half. Inch and a half. Well, we got to tap that one stuck one. Yeah. Once we do that, it'll free up. Okay. Plus the valves that are stuck. Speaking of that, we got a valve stuck open on the head over there. We need to give yeah, it that's up. That's fine. Just solid, like even this one, you can feel. Yeah. This one, there's you don't feel anything. And it's just, right on the bottom. It's just problem. part of the block. And with it right at the bottom of the stroke, you don't want to hit. The same problem. Yeah, it's Let's probably see. supposed to be coming up. Let's see this one here. Yeah, but didn't it drain out? Let's fill it with some gibbs. I think they they all did. Do you have a, 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 a dowel of wood one. or a, well, I'm just a using piece of firewood? Let me go get a piece of firewood. Because if that drains past, then that isn't seized. And if it, so which other one did you say was not moving? Well, this one doesn't appear to be moving, but you can right. feel the thunk yeah. thunk. Okay. Yeah. This one, you don't even feel the thunk right. thunk. Okay. To me, rings are just become part of the, yeah. the block. This was an achievement that had never been even dreamed of. It was a single casting of a V8 block. Unbelievable achievement in metallurgy. And 20 years later, it was obsolete. Because it was supposed to be more efficient in manufacturing? Yeah, oh, well, you're trying to make... This was like a very... Like only Cadillacs had V8s. And, like to make idea. a V8 for... Oh, look at you. Oh, that's, that's a nice... Perfect. Is it one draining, Miles? Yes, slowly. Okay. Is this one all the way down? Oh, no, no, it's not quite. That's, might be, that's uh, good. That means we're not going to wreck anything. starting. Like, should you be hitting the other ones? Well, kind part of, of me wants to no. hit this again, it, but I if it's it not quite a little bit. this one, you felt yeah. it moved? Okay, well, if that moved, then they're all moving. But These are all loose. Like something's... this, you can move it with your fingers. What like about the back loose. one? I hate the fact that they're right at the top. We just don't know where they want to go, right? Well, yeah. this was the one that was rusted solid. Yeah. Right, so I'm not too worried about the other ones. What I'm doing is that helping you? I, yeah, it yeah, absolutely is. is because yeah. we can't trust any of what we're doing unless you're doing that. Everything moving, not moving? Any yeah, thoughts? same, 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 no change. Okay. This guy just seems really solid. What am I picking out of here? Is this just wood or is that probably just most scraps of wood. some wood? Not sure. Go what about those. um. Valves, if they're seized in the block and it's riding on the camshaft, they're giving you tons of resistance too. Yeah, for sure. But not as much as what we're seeing. Have you already hit all these? No, I'm not hitting anything. I mean the valves with Oh, gibs. oiled them, yes. Yeah. And feel free to do all the cylinders again, especially just so to confirm they're draining. Because if they are, they're not stuck. I know these All don't these work. drained out. So this is the one that's stuck. And it's obviously like this was full totally. of fucking rust. 100%. And the rest of them were not. The rest of them were like fine. So, and when it goes, it's gonna, you're going to be able to move the wheel an inch, then two inches, then three inches. And then we're going to get, then everything stops and we clean and we sand. And then you'll be able to roll it right over. And then we just crank it over and then it starts. Easy. But it all hinges on beating. This Andy has the perfect 
the stick because we can yeah, okay. but we're not getting a huge amount of thrust out of this because a lot of it's being yeah. absorbed. By Where's your meat. sledge? That's when you gotta hit it hard. Right, I'm not in any panic. No, no, you can no. always hit it harder. But I think you that we are gonna have some movement here within five minutes. That's all I did to the Chevy and it was way stucker. Okay, take a break. Let's have a look. How do they look? Nice. Little little surface of the moon, little pitting from sitting. But what kind of chops that cam got there? Uh, mild, I'm sure. It's far too mild. What's the offy book say for these guys? What are the what are the options? Yeah, right. <laughs> what was this motor anyway? 259. 259. Didn't Studebaker have a 327 at some point? They did. Off? This was that was a later offshoot of this. Yeah. Well, it's got a little rusty from no, sitting there, eh? Not much. I went to. The but otherwise, uh, just a little I pitting. Think that, no, yeah. Well, that's. I think that means the hard hardening's oh, going on them. Right. Doesn't that mean? Isn't that what that means? So Probably. Just, uh, or is that just pitting? But yeah. I think the stripes are from sitting. The stripes are from sitting. For sure. For sure. So we know that the cam. Oh, look at like that. They're solid. Uh, are they solid lifters? Yeah. They shouldn't be. I'll be damned. They're solid. That's why those push rods are so bloody long. Uh, that's also and that's why they're adjustable, right? It's a mechanical flat tappet cam. I'm telling you, this this motor is nothing but power. <laughs> She's gonna put out. Nice. Okay, so that's one issue we don't have to worry about. Look how clean that is in there. Like the distributor teeth are all clean. <clears throat> So once we break this thing loose, so we should vacuum all the shit out from around yeah. the hole. Yeah, I was just thinking. Yeah, we're then about maybe, to dump all Maybe put, put the cover there. back on or stuff it with rags. Yeah, now we're gonna. Maybe we'll put the cover back on, but let me clean it up. Okay. Hey guys, welcome to VH Showdown. Uh, we did something similar a few years ago with straight eights. Figured we should try it again with a couple of V8 cars. The fun thing about this for me is that these are both cars that I just think are awesome and that I would like to see running anyway. And the fact that they're both V8 cars and both two-door hardtops, uh, actually uh, pretty pretty sweet cars overall. Of course, the condition leaves something to be desired. Nevertheless, uh, I think both of these cars will be improved by being uh, more or less turnkey units if this goes okay. Of course, we have on our left here uh, the 1958 Studebaker. I bought this a few years ago. Derivatives of this engine uh, stroked 289 ran right till the end of Studebaker Corporation in the mid to late 60s. Uh, Studebaker actually lasted a couple of extra years in Canada. So uh, anyhow, uh, a fun old car and uh, the one year only uh, full body on frame two-door hardtop, actually a pretty rare car. You could argue that the styling is a little bit iffy, but uh, nevertheless, it makes it a really fun car. Of course, the Ford Victoria, Ford's first hardtop as well. So two uh, first-year hardtops here. And the Ford Sporting, of course, probably the most famous uh, V8 of all time, the Ford Flathead V8, uh, the first mass-produced, low-cost V8, and uh, pretty much impossible to overstate how important this engine is. Uh, we have one of the later derivatives here. Uh, the last few model years were uh, enlarged to uh, 239 cubic inch, somewhere just north of 100 horsepower, and a, uh, a legendary engine. And they have a fantastic sound, which I hope we get to experience. Unless it's the sound of it being pushed off the back of the truck into a scrap metal bin. So. I want to say a very sincere thanks to our friend Jonathan W. down in South Carolina who has just located a second 1956 Studebaker Golden Hawk running the Packard 352 V8. Uh, anyway, he uh, very kindly mentioned our uh, show in this little contest on his channel there. And so uh, if you're not already following one of the, uh, one of the finest uh, self-taught engineers uh, on YouTube, you should be. Uh, he's just doing a bottomless number of amazing projects. So uh, I would like to, uh, you know, maybe we can, maybe we can talk him into uh, getting his uh, Packard-powered Studebaker 
uh, V8 running as we uh, as we do these. So uh, send them a note, uh, tell them hi from us, and uh, that's awesome. If you're not already subscribed, of course you should be subscribed to Jonathan W. Let's get busy. This is a regular ah, same old shit.
You're not doing the same fucking thing yeah, day right. after day. Yeah. Like this guy. Exactly. Same thing day yeah. after day. Day after, after day. Exactly. Those are sweet suspenders. Oh. But those are nice. I like oh. those ones. Well, I... Huh? Those no, nice. I need those fuckers. <laughs> God, my pants won't stay up. Well, they're nice. Those are nice ones. Yeah, they look good. Fucking fancy. Sharp. Well... Like you're going to a I was gonna I, I was gonna get a couple of bungee straps and just oh, hook it in here and cut it right Fuck, over the yeah. fucking back. Some like, bungees. No, she says I got you suspenders ten years ago. She says I don't know where they are. <laughs> so she got looking for them and yeah, sure enough. Sure enough, they're there. Yeah. Oh, it's warm, eh? Holy. Oh fuck yeah. Are they are they moving yet? Uh have you tried? No, I haven't tried. Oh. So you need you need the wrench for that one, is that? Yeah, right? that's right. This one we can just turn the back wheel, but this one's automatic. Yeah, well, just weld well, the fucking three Well, you're not turning fucking. the wheels fast enough. That's, that's what right. the problem is. It's got to turn the wheel forty miles an hour. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck.